Hello everyone, Hamel here with the daily market update. First a quick disclaimer. Okay, so another day and another okay day for the market. So most indexes were up today, which is good. So they continued their slow march upwards. So SPY was up 0.16% uh, here. Let's look at uh, Q's was up 0.55 again it continues its march upwards iwm it was lower by 0.36 uh, and that being said it's still at a higher high and a higher low which is good and it's in a very nice gentle uptrend there let's look at 50 so this one is now officially breaking out if you look at the weekly chart we can see this one is just now breaking out uh, from this prior resistance here which is all positive as well Let's look at uh, Dow. Dow was down a little bit. Again, it is uh, tightening up here, continues to do so. ACWI was also higher about 0.25%. So everything was higher today. Let's get back to spiders. So it looks like uh, another leg up higher is uh, it's probably what it looks like. I believe they're getting closer to stimulus. Again, we don't really know for sure. However, a lot of these are breaking out. I showed monthly charts yesterday. So, and again, I, when I talk about indexes, I'm pretty much talking about my 401k, which is restricted. And then individual stocks are a whole different story. Those are stock specific analysis. I only have so much time because I work full time. So I do what I can. So I, I don't have time every day to go, even for myself, go over and screen for stocks. I just uh, have a list of stocks I watch and then I make my decisions on a daily basis when time permits. But pretty much I'm still in the market, 99.7%. But I'm going to start raising cash over the course of next few days because my thesis still stands. You know, bullish sentiments, it's at very high level. So at some point, there will be some kind of pullback. And I don't want to give everything back when that happens. So there is a fine line. So I may sacrifice some gains not to give back gains. So there's always a balance. We are never going to get every penny we're never going to get out on the top of the market unless you're lucky once so it, it's always a balancing act at least in my opinion so this is one thing i wanted to show you so let's look at line charts so this is absolute breadth so typically it's higher at the lows so we can see this uh, this uh, was very high at the lows right here that means the most stocks were participating now as it's stopping out, this tends to get lower. So we can see it is getting down lower. Now, the, it is diverging actually because SPY is making a higher high, whereas this one did make a higher high, but now it's trending on the opposite direction because this continues upwards. This is going downwards, right? So that's that proves that less and less stocks are working every single day and that has been a problem in my portfolio it, it's not going up as quickly as it used to even though it is at all-time highs which is good which uh, i appreciate that but it is not going up as quickly as it used to so i definitely want to make sure that uh, i'm paying attention to that as well so that that's all i have so not much change again another leg higher uh, we'll see how high it can go and then uh, I will continue to cash in uh, as I as my stocks are making progress. Continue to uh, pretty much uh, cash in and uh, book the gains. So I hope everyone is doing well. Have a good one. Take care.